hello and welcome to my channel you already know that i am launching new playlist where i am uploading microsoft power bi related tutorial regularly in this continuation today i will show you how to create and customize area chart in microsoft power bi so let's start first open microsoft power bi desktop and then import the data so from here I want to import my CSV file so I am selecting CSV then connect open it so here is my data as I do not need to clean anything so I am directly load my data this is my sample data you can also see the table from here here I have date information manufacturing cost sales price country list product information so let's create an area chart from this data so for this select on area chart suppose i want to show the sales information year wise so for this i will drag and drop the date information in x axis mm -hmm. and the sales information in y axis so this is our chart here we have two year 2013 and 2014 let's say i want to show the sales information only 2014 so you can filter from here click on basic filtering and then select 2014 now here we have only 2014 sales information here after year we have quarter information month information and day information let's say i want to show the sales information monthly then you can select you can click on here this is the quarter information of sales in sales and this is the monthly information of sales so you can also add the manufacturing cost information in y axis now we have sales information and manufacturing cost information so let's change the title of this chart general then title and convert it to bold and keep it keep the title in the middle of the chart you can also change the text from here uh, and also you can increase the size of this text okay click on line you can uh, change the line style solely to dot it in my case i keep it as solid you can also uh, increase the stroke width or decrease it in the color let's say manufacturing cost i want it uh, as red color you can change the transparency from here so it's okay now let's say uh, you want to add uh, an average line in here so you can find this in this section from here go to the average line as i want to add two line one for sales and another for manufacturing cost so i am adding two line here first one is sales and the second one is manufacturing cost of goods for the sales price you can change the style from dash to solid okay i want it as dashed and the data level i'm showing the data level here let's say i am changing the data level unit display unit from here you can easily change it to million for the this one manufacturing cost of goods so let's select this one and change the color to this one so it will match with the area line information and for sales turn on the data level 
choose the display in it in million now you can say easily that average sales in 2014 is 7.69 million and the average cost of good in 2014 is 6.69 million roughly 1.08 million profit from here you can add a marker to this information for better uh, visualization so for this go to formatted visual then click on here markers it turn on this marker now i think you can easily interpret the information monthly so this is how you can use area chart in microsoft power bi and now i will show you how to add information from a website and use it in area chart gross domestic product so let's use this information in area chart first you have to copy this link and open microsoft power bi in the get data select this web now paste the link and click on ok you will see a list of table information here but in my case i will use this one gross domestic product this is the information that i want to use so first i will transform this data as i need to clean this information before use it in axis so this is the table information i do not need this column so i'm deleting this and i want to use the first row as header so i am click on the uh, country the data type is text the rest of the one is also okay this is the gross domestic product in billion in 2025 its data type is in whole number so it's okay let's say i want to show only the uh, five countries from here in my analysis so click on this keep top rows i'm typing here five now it will keep only the top five row, rows and the rest of the rows will be deleted from here and now here i have five country and the corresponding gross domestic product from 2010 to 2050 first i have to uh, convert this column information in row before do the analysis so for this select the column that I want to co uh, convert into row using my control key and then go to the transform and unpivot column so here my country and the, this is the year information and gross domestic product let's uh, rename this column the year and this is the gross domestic product i think my data are okay now close and apply to load the data in the power bi desktop so here is my data let's create a area chart from uh, this data for this click on the area chart again let's say i want to show the gross domestic product year wise for each country so drag the year in x axis and the gross domestic product in y axis okay and as i want this information country wise so i am choosing the country as legend so here my uh, country wise gross domestic product you can start it from 2010 here go to the use ascending now we have the information from 2010 to 2015 in 2010 top country was united state in case of gross domestic product but in 2050 china will be top so area charts uh, is useful in visualizing uh, important information in your data so i think uh, you will like this tutorial uh, please subscribe to my channel for regular tutorial like this.